Bozzy bear. There he is. Like I said, guys, the ju just the giant egg. As I've said before, without his hat, he's pretty scary. But we've got Fuzzy Bear. And what's nice now is that we're going to better take a look at his actual moves and see what they're going to consist of. So obviously we looked at the leak videos last week. And um, oh, look how cool that is. Fuzzy shoots water out of his um, flower, which causes him to fly across the battlefield and soak enemies dealing damage. So I wonder if that's a fires it behind him and flies across, or he like hovers on the top. I don't know, but that... Um, that's going to be pretty creepy, that move, guys, I think. That's going to be quite a scary move. And then we've got Waka Waka. Fozzie tells a corny joke and gets the hook, but grabs a random enemy, knocking them back and stunning them. So that's pretty cool. You know, like when you see like weird cartoons and it just comes out of nowhere and goes zoink and pulls you away. It's kind of like that, but it's, it's going to be more of like a smack on the head and knocks them back. Our applause... Once per wave, when he reaches 0 HP, the audience cheers, heals him, and he gains stacks of hardy. So that's pretty cool, because what that does straight away is allows him to have two lives. So he's going to be able to sit on your team, die, and come back. So if you had him and Hades, they'd both have to die and come back. So there's something to think about there, but that's pretty cool. Nothing's standing out to me incredibly at the moment. Compared to, like, say, a character like Carl, I don't see why you'd use Fosley Bear instead. But still quite cool. I like the idea of round of applause. I can really see that doing some um, good, guys. But like, like I said, kind of just at the moment a little bit, mm, nothing stood out to me. Which is a shame for the 30th anniversary character. A little bit of a shame, but anyway. Bad joke. Fuzzy's cheesy jokes cause any enemies to lose energy each time he damages an enemy with a basic attack. So that's actually quite cool. Um, I like the idea, like, the jokes are so boring, and just like, ugh, just can't be bothered. Losing energy with this act, I quite like that. And any time he does a normal attack, they lose skill power. Any time he uses a special, they lose skill power. So we could see something quite good going on there, with people losing a lot of skill power. Which is obviously going to be a very, very important thing. And that, you know, keeping Ian special away, keeping Kermit from using his special, making everybody invincible... That could be really, really good. There's a lot of potential there, depending on how well that actually works. Then we've got Stand Up Act. Waka Waka also reduces the attack and movement speed of enemies. That's good. Um, so, sorry. It reduces the attack and movement speed of the enemy stunned until they damages enemies with a basic attack. It reduces the attack and movement speed of the... Why would you need to decrease the attack and movement speed of a stunned enemy until they damage enemies with basic attack? I'm not too sure about that one. Enemies with attack or movement speed reduction deal less damage to Fozzy. That's quite good. Um, because obviously, uh, you can do quite a cool thing with like, if you have loads of people, a team who do loads of... Um, I've just lost the world of speed. <laughs> if, you just, if you do a load of people who actually are able to have all these attack reductions and debuffs, then Fozzy should be able to stay alive for a very long time. He's got his battle badge. Like I said, I haven't actually made it to yellow yet, so I'm not quite there with the battle badge, but that's all pretty good. Then we've got the friendships. 